A crime alert tonight. The chairman of the Charlotte Citizens Review Board is accused of sexually assaulting two women over 22 years. 49 year old Henry Black was arrested this morning in Myrtle Beach. Police say the sexual assault started when the victims were kids and took place between 1996 and 2018. What's even more disturbing, these victims told others about the assault and those people did nothing to help them. NBC Charlotte's Tanya Mendez reached out to victim advocates today. Tanya, what did they have to say about all of this? Well, they say it's not uncommon for survivors to not seek help, especially if they speak up and they're not believed. Business owner and chairman of the Citizen Review Board, Henry Black Jr. has been a prominent member of the Charlotte community for years. Police say he's also been an abuser for years. 22 years they have been pushing and telling people this, and finally it got into the hands of law enforcement. Police say Black sexually abused two little girls until they were grown women. The details disturbing the to even the most seasoned detectives. detectives. They see a lot, and in this case, it gave them pause. It did. The details gave them pause. Detectives now looking into whether there could be more. Black is the president of Genesis Project One, a Charlotte-based organization that helps families and children, especially kids who are at risk or experienced trauma. The investigation has not made any connections yet, but it is a potential. Police say making matters worse. The girls told people what was happening, including people who have a legal duty to report and no one did a thing about it. It's inexcusable. It's, it's completely inexcusable. And it could be criminal. Advocates who work with survivors of sexual abuse say it takes a lot of courage to speak up once. And not only are survivors already questioning themselves when they've done absolutely nothing wrong, and it is never their fault, but you have society that is having a constant dialogue around what that survivor could have done differently. To continue speaking up until someone took them seriously, something CMPD says is almost unheard of. And knowing that for 22 years, these survivors have pushed and pushed and pushed, and now it's here, that's superhuman from what they're, what they're overcoming, and they have to overcome every day. Well, it's even more difficult when the accused is in a position of power. In this case, Black is the head of the Citizen Review Board, which polices the police and potential misconduct. He was appointed by the city manager himself. He's now suspended, though, because he's the one who's in trouble. Reporting at CMPD headquarters, I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte.